And Norfolk says it's saving money and saving lives by using a new ventilation tube invented by one of its doctors. The Queen Elizabeth Hospital says it's almost eradicated pneumonia in intensive care patients as a result. Dr Young's responsible for one extra person per week walking the streets of Norfolk. Why? Because of this tube he designed. I noticed that quite a few of our patients would have the feed that we put into the patient's stomachs when they're very unwell coming out of their lungs. And so I started looking in a bit more detail about why that was occurring and discovered that actually the cuffs on the tubes that we currently use allowed fluid to just flow straight past them. The syringe here represents the lungs. The dye would be food and saliva. This standard tube doesn't seal properly, so it leaks straight into the lungs. And this is the new tube, no drips. And as a result, the bacteria is stopped. The patient avoids pneumonia. They do cost the hospital more though, up to £10,000 a year. But with fewer cases of the infection to treat, they save around £100,000. So will every hospital use them? there's a certain reticence to outlaying the extra money because obviously, as you imagine, it's, it's very obvious when you're spending extra money for a new piece of equipment, it's much more difficult to see the money that you're saving uh, in terms of reducing the duration of time you're looking after patients. News of its success is now spreading. Hospitals in Europe and America have now started using the Norfolk-born device. Victoria Cook, BBC Look East, Kings Lynn.